Hello and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas of yours truly loaders into the mad. Now last time we killed some bears, I think, and we suppose we took care of some assignments. We must have because some of them are gone. Uh, Alright, there's enemies in that direction as well though. Let's go check them out. And then I wish to return to the game we were in. Uh, where we found that map. This is Pine Creek. One of the only ways out of Zion Valley. Watch out. Many dangerous beasts lair nearby. Nifty. Uh, one of, there is a set of equipment somewhere over where I was before that we did not check out before because I was uh, too busy worrying about other things, I guess. Are there more enemies? There are. Nice. Kill him. Good job, Rex. Killing these bears helps me level up quite well, so there is that. And that is a container now. This supposedly is one of the few ways out of Zion. I don't suppose we can take it just yet. Right? There are no invisible walls, so... That is not keeping me out, but I'm sure... There is something else. Like this log! Look, it has loot! Loot! You quickly peer through it. That's exactly what I wasn't looking for, though. The Pine Creek Tunnel. And there's the kicker. We can't use this tunnel. Yay! Great. Exactly what I needed to know. No, what was it? The Morning Glory game? That can't be right. Huh. Where was it the ghost then? No, no, that's where the ghost was. Surprisingly enough. I'm going to check the morning glory game just to be safe. This is in fact not the place. Okay. Alright, so... Where is Daniel? Over that way? Is it gonna rain again? Because I thought the sound just went sl slightly buggy again. Don't really know where he might be, Daniel. Yeah, it's raining. Rain, for some reason, always starts with white noise, which is annoying. Just a short burst of full volume noise. I should look into that, but uh, I just I haven't gotten around to it. Looks like Daniel is down there. So is Joshua. Right? I'm glad to see you're still with us. How can I help you? Uh, I checked on everything in the valley and got you the map of Grand Staircase. I appreciate it. Well, that's it. This is all we need. Now all that's left is to quietly pack up and try to get out of here without being noticed. That's assuming that Joshua won't try to stop me. And that he hasn't talked you into fighting the White Legs despite what I've said. Don't worry, I don't hold it against you. You're a... an outsider. Fighting seems like the practical solution. I'll tell you again. There's more at stake. Ooh. We should fight the fi uh, white legs for this mission. For this character, anyway. <sighs> no. Why? Why? Haven't you seen enough of what's going on here to see that the sorrows don't need to butcher the white legs for a piece of land? What Joshua wants is more than an attack, he wants a slaughter. And he needs more than you and the dead horses to do it. The sorrows can't be pushed into this. You and Joshua don't have the right to force them into it, please. 
consider what I'm saying. And you have the right to pull them off of their land. I've already explained to them that we're leaving. They've accepted it. What is Joshua going to tell them about being a warrior? What are you going to tell them about how to live with themselves after they got lost in the moment, killed someone who didn't deserve to die? Or does that not matter? Is that just an acceptable consequence if it means holding on to this valley? Maybe there is no place left in this world for mercy. But even if it tramples me into the dust, I will never accept it. And I will never condone it. Joshua must be waiting for you. I'll stay here with the others as I told them I would. Oh. Thank you for this. I know Daniel doesn't approve, but destroying the White Legs is the only way to ensure the sorrows can remain in Zion. You and I will lead a group of dead horse warriors and sorrows hunters into Three Marys from this position. Our objective is to find the White Legs leader, salt upon wounds, and prevent him from fleeing. Show no quarter to the White Legs we come across. Make no mistake about why we are here. This is an extermination. That's good. God be with you. They have the Canaanite cook. But it's a good thing I'm using one of those guns. Yeah? Okay, cool. Um. It's dark. Full of terrors. Let's wait in the morning. That's better. Alright. The quest marker shows this direction, so that's where we're headed first. Probably get to kill a couple of people before we get to where we need to be. We should probably check the map to see exactly what sort of route I'm meant to take. That's the sort of map I'm meant to take. And uh, I cannot fast travel, so this will be a journey. For sure. Maybe I should have gone from below because this doesn't appear to be an actual route. Hmm. Alright, well we reset combat because there's someone standing right over there. It's a white leg spoon breaker. I should have stepped up close. Didn't seem to work as well as I was hoping for. I'm now sorry fighting. Hmm? I really can't tell. Weird noises everywhere. Okay, so there's one, and the white low on health, which isn't surprising since I'm not really doing very well, I guess. Um, but someone else is doing quite well. That's a shish kebab. I'm taking it. I don't know if I want to use it myself, but I'm certainly taking it for myself. We'll see about the uses, I guess. Hmm. I do know there is a set of armor in the valley somewhere, which I might be interested in. Alright. I saw him turn red. So I know he's going to be evil. On the other hand, I don't think this pistol has the range. Oh, it's much simpler than that. That's it. Take it. 
Men det kan man. Where did the second one go? Someone over there. That's it. I think I managed Die to scratch them. Stand. Joshua is being very supportive of this whole thing. And I still don't have to do anything. Are my my arms are okay? Good. This requires Why can't they shoot things now? There is of course the fact that this is probably not meant to be a long range weapon. But you know, that's irrelevant. That's that's just silly. That doesn't matter. At all. No so as in probably so. Uh, the <laughs> game that I started the series on yesterday just finished downloading. That's nice, isn't it? It is. Makes perfect sense, doesn't it? Yeah. All right. I. We have already done this walk before, Joshua. You weren't with us, but we were here. We killed folks. It was weird because uh, apparently someone, someone, not saying, not telling any names, managed to get into a fight with a Yagwai. And uh, as such, we were permanently in combat. And I was unable to see if I could make something nice for myself on the cooking thingy. Campfire? Yeah? Now I'm just constantly right clicking to see if there is any one I can shoot. Answer is probably no. It is nice that they don't notice me trying to shoot them. Once again, thank you Joshua for actually finishing up the job, or was it you, Boone? Either way, I didn't have to do too much, because I'm apparently not very good at doing too much. Firebombs. Taking them. And... I don't really need to be refined water, do I? Yeah. I am carrying a lot of stuff there. Can I repair this with something useless, like a hunting revolver or that? Yeah. That, that worked. I still don't have anything to repair that with there. Oh, there we go. That's it. Take it. No stealth strike? Oh well. Thank you, Boon. At least I think that one was Boon's work. Could probably just get the, uh, you know, working on some different weapons than a pistol. I think I have lots of ammo for various things. It's just a hunting rifle that's running really low. And what else do I have there? A hunting shotgun is not gonna work. I can repair it there. Um, the trail garbine probably shakes like crazy. It probably did, we probably ch checked it already. And I guess that leaves me with pistols, primarily. Can also repair my submachine gun now What's going on with armor? Not too much. Use the box for an outfit <laughs> to repair things. Nice. Okay. Let's go. We have things to kill. We have missions to accomplish. 
Oh, what does that say? Ranger substation Eagle. Have you been there? Have you been at Eagle? Uh, according to my memory and the map, I have indeed been at Eagle, so I suppose we can go this way. Because Eagle went up here. So that, that did give me the advantage of following the edge of the cliff, and as such, only having to worry about enemies on one side. Lots of enemies around there. Good thing I have an army. Someone is shooting me. Oh. Someone else we should fight us as well. Uh, there's so many things to do. It. I'm almost leveled up there. That's nice. Yeah, give me your drill carbine. That's a really good weapon, actually. Value-wise, anyway. It's great value. Let's repair it and uh, try to smuggle it to the gun runners. Yeah. Oh, so shish kebab. Did I repair the shish kebabs? Also, how much do I... How good do I have to be at shish kebabbing to shish kebab? Shish kebab. It's at five. Ooh, yeah. I'm not close to that yet. I haven't even started leveling up melee. I will have to do. I will have to. Maybe once I've got my my guns, science bear, and a lot of that fluff nicely maxed out or something, that could work. I know there's some things I wish to avoid leveling up for a time. Just so I can... Do some things my way. Alright. I don't know how to catch up to the rest of the party over there. There is... This sounds like they're having a hell of a time. But... 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 map, what do you think? I think I should go... South, find the canyon entrance. I'm gonna continue along that. Yeah, that could work, I suppose. I guess. Also, Boone, I think I'm going to give you some armor once we have actually located what you seek. It's a good thing we have an army. Wait, 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 wait. Don't just level me up randomly. I'm gonna... Oh, okay. If that's how you want to be. Sure. Guns, though. Gonna need guns. Gonna need a lot of guns. We won't need too much speak, but uh, it's... Might as well get it to some level. What else was I really trying to level up there? I don't know. Let's get repair and science equalized. Done. No perks this level. Sad times all around. Hmm. Ammo do. Got more ammo for the pistol. Which we'll need because I've been using up the pistol ammo. By not being able to aim at all. Properly or otherwise. So, let's see. Where do we go? That's... It looked like that was fading the closer I got, which was weird. Ah, Dream Marys. Nice. Let's go tell them hi. Joshua, get your killing face on. It's time for me to set you on fire so you can be the burning man. From the nightmares. <laughs> what do you mean you don't want to actually be on fire for this? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Traumatic memories, what? No. 
No, 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 no. It's a superpower now. Whatever does it kill you makes you stronger, you know? Being on fire didn't kill you once, so... Clearly, it must make you stronger now. Or I might be a terrible person. That's also a possibility. Let's kill your friends. We've got sorrows, we've got dead horses. And we have more monuments. Nice. And we have the end of the episode. So thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Mm. Delicious. This sec. Water.